and welcome to my channel. I'm Bargo. In this how to video, I'm going to show you how to reformat your external hard disk. So by default, your external hard disk comes with NTFS format, which is usable only on Windows operating system. So in order to able to use it on both Mac and Windows, you need to reformat it to XFAT. So when you reformat to XFAT, make sure your hard disk is empty. In case if that's a brand new hard disk and if you're reformatting it absolutely no issues but if you have data in it make sure to take a backup because once you reformat it every data will be lost if you don't have backup so make sure you have backup or else your total data is lost so it's just a matter of few steps until you uh, reformat it so when I did this reformat on my Mac laptop, initially I faced some errors. So that might be because it's already a read-only uh, hard disk. So I used a Windows laptop to reformat it. So in case if you are facing any issue and if you are trying it on Mac, try to erase the data even if it's a empty brand new hard disk. Just um, there is an option I will show you in a minute. So do erase the data and try to reformat it. In the drop down menu, just select Reform XFAT. I'm going to show you in the screen uh, share now. So, if you still face issue on Mac and if you have access to any Windows uh, OS, just try to use that laptop or desktop to reformat it. And after that, you will be able to use it on both <coughs> Windows and Mac. Let's see how we can reformat it. As you plug in your hard disk, it will just appear here. Open your hard disk if it's a brand new. You can just install it so I've already installed it so I'm going I'm just going to see the version here so once it is installed by default it will be a read-only uh, format in order to reformat it open utilities go to disk utility you will see your hard disk name here just open it by default as I said it's NTFS format So you will see the basic mount and the space availability details. So click on erase and choose XFAT. So this is the format that is required to use on both Windows and Mac laptops. So click on erase. Now I got an error because I don't know why I just got an error. So I used Windows laptop. I just plugged in, clicked on, right click on hard disk and clicked on format. So from the drop down select xfat this is the file system that you require just uh, click that make sure you have backup so there will be a warning just click on ok and it will be done within within a minute within a second that's it so once this is done and when you use it in mac laptop you won't see the mount initially it will just show as zero availability and it will not be mounted in fact so you need to mount it now for the first time use so once you reformat it it will show as xfat format but you won't see the mount available so click on erase again and choose the same format there are other formats available but we need xfat select it and there are additional security options that are available so whichever is feasible for you choose that and click on erase now new mount will be created and you are good to use and this is the utility you can choose if you want to use that's it so it is created now you are good to use on both mac and windows so mount is created hard disk is good to use so that's how reformat is done for a hard disk thank you for watching this video guys do let me know if it was helpful in the comments don't forget to subscribe thank you see you in another video